Creepers! What's going on, you crazy creeps? It is Clearski, and I am back. How the heck are you guys? It is a absolutely beautiful day here in East County, Gresham. We are just east of Portland, Oregon. We are just creeping along today. I thought I would say, heck it! Kind of like Adam the Woo style. <laughs> Love that guy. And uh, do some street interviews today. Just kind of figure out and get to feel how people are feeling. We're going to take to the streets today and just do some random interviews about the current situation. A lot of counties here in Oregon have lowered their restrictions and things of that nature. So we're just going to kind of check in and go straight to the streets. Stay tuned. Today's going to be a good one, guys. That's what I call my, my followers, by the way, is Creepers. Creepers? Okay. So my channel's Clear Ski the Creeper, and I, I call them the Creepers because they've been so good to me. But some people go, what did I sign up for? <laughs> it's a good Creeper. You guys know that. So anyways, we're walking down the trail, and I figured, heck it, we're going to do something kind of a little different. You know, we've talked to a lot of folks over the years and interviewed people, but I just want to be out on the streets in Portland, well, Gresham, Portland, and interview a couple folks today and see how they're feeling, how what they feel with the new situation. Um, so today we have... Janet. Janet. I knew that, actually. I just... <laughs> we're pretending like we just kind of met, even though we've been talking for a minute, but <laughs> Janet is here, and we've just kind of just been talking about how things are right now. And like I said, I'm gonna get a couple different people's opinions, but I just wanted to know kind of how you are feeling with the current situation. You know, we're going into like, you know, a different phase or whatever they're calling it. Um, you know, do you think it's too late, too early? What do you feel like? How are you, how are you feeling? How have you been holding up this whole time kind of thing? Well, I, I hate the quarantine. I, I, I am a people person. Yeah. I, I'm. I don't mind being separated from strangers. I mind not being able to hug my family. Okay. I mind not being able to see the persons that are not in my bubble. So, and they are more afraid than I am, some of them. Um, and the winter time is always hard for, you know, always hard for people True. in the Pacific Northwest. So It really um, is. That's why the sun feels so great today too, by the way. Exactly. And I posted, I posted a live video on my Facebook about, um, about getting out and getting in the sun. I don't care where you're at, even if you sit on your patio for five minutes. Heck yeah. Um, it really can change your way of thought. Um, yeah. I am looking forward to the vaccination. Um, one of my adult children has already been vaccinated. She lives in California. Um, my other two, uh, two of my other daughters are going to California. We're hoping they'll get vaccinated while they're there. Uh, and I am hoping to be vaccinated beginning of April. Nice. Supposed so things are moving in your mind pretty good. I, it, it's, it could have been a lot better. It could have been handled a lot better in the beginning, but I'm not going to go there. I'm yep. going to stay positive. <laughs> um, we could be where we're at now seven months ago if we had listened to the science. You said you're going to get on there too and become a creeper. So I thank will. you so much, Jana. I appreciate your time. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you guys, we're back for another interview here. We're still on the spring water. And uh, gosh, remind me your name? Uh, Jim. Jim, I see Jim all the time walking and we just casually say hello to each other. But today I had to stop him and just ask him, how are you feeling, man? I'm out here just kind of going directly to the streets and getting people's opinions. Do you think we're moving too fast, you know, with everything that's been going on? Do you feel like things are too slow, too fast, just right? How you feeling? Uh, it'd be nice if I could move this fast, which I guess we're going to try to do, but the uh, problem is um, kind of disregarding science. But of course, the dollar talks. So that's what we're doing. We're yep. Give it a try. Yep. I'm go to, I'm going to Vegas. See it's what kind, happens of, kind of a gamble. Well, well, let's give it a try. We don't need any more um, uh, oh, revolts or whatever you want to say, any more insurrection attempts or anything like that. So. Uh, you know, if they want to go along with this and it leads to other things, I mean, that's what the people want to do. That's yep. They can have, have it their way. Well, thank you so much for your thoughts. I appreciate that. And I know you're like me where little common courtesies go a long way. Just, I mean, we don't really know each other other than just passing each other on the trail and saying hello. I mean, that goes a long way when you just give somebody the common head nod or hello in my book. Yeah. Yeah, I and I think that, 
be a better world if uh, everyone could be kind. I agree. Thanks so much, brother. Enjoy your walk. See you soon. So we're out just creeping around today. I hope you're enjoying your day because it is beautiful. Yeah. And uh, I'm just out really just asking people what their opinions are on this, the current situation. Do you feel like, you know, we might be moving too fast, too slow? How are you feeling? For COVID-19 response? Correct. Well, I just Or just in general. Just in general. Um, yeah, I probably don't have it's in general, I'm comfortable, I'm retired, life is good. Nice. So I don't see any downside for me with what's happening. Do you think we're on the right path right now? Like, do you think by this time next year, things will go back to quote unquote normal? It'll take longer than that, but I would hope within a couple years. Couple years. And you think, you think everybody's, uh, well, at least for me, I feel like it's very necessary right now for all of us to just really get along to be in layman's terms. I mean, everybody's got their own feelings and opinions, but I feel just the majority of the folks I've talked to with as well feel kind of the same. Yeah, I think so. And I don't run into any animosity of uh, being following the guidelines for COVID. I don't interact with very many people. Um, I was involved earlier today with handing out food boxes. Oh, nice. To our church. We all do our own little part right now. It can only get better. Well, I would hope so. Awesome. That's very honorable of you, too, to do the food boxes for folks and things of that. Not, it's not very much, but, you know, you're moving in the right direction and helping people. Heck yeah. And we can make an appointment. So we have appointments next week. Very nice for you and your wife to both get the vaccine. Yeah. So we're all, you feel like we're on the right track. I definitely feel that way. And probably two weeks ago, you would have got a different response from me. That's true. Well, thank you so much for your time. It, I think it's just good to interact with folks right now, too, and just kind of feel day. for each other. You too, buddy. Thank you so much for your time. Appreciate you. Don't have a lot going on. Yeah? Get by the day. Do you guys feel like... By this time next year, everything will be kind of back to normal, or what do you think? It's going to be what it's going to be. It's been interesting times. There's a Chinese curse that goes, may you live in exciting times. There you go. I think we is, that a, is that a curse or a good fortune? Well, it depends. You know, most times when I've lived in exciting times, shit was hit the fan. So I'd just as soon not be excited. <laughs> well, thank you for your time. I appreciate you guys. Have a good day, brother. There you have it. He seems to be pretty positive about the situation. And uh, most folks, I think, are. So things are, things are going okay. That's going to do it for today. Make sure you guys give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy this vlog. You can ring that bell. That way when I creep, you guys will be the first to creep. Creeper out for now. Peace.